Ahoy there cruisers and welcome aboard the unfinished MSC Bellissima. Let's go take a look around. Watch your hands. Yeah, watch out for those dangling now. Wow, this is nuts. This is awesome. <laughs> Just like wires and stuff like that. This is what the staircase looks like. Yeah, this is the staircase, guys. That's mad. So, guys, just behind us is the passageway for the crew. So, it's the, the part of the ship where they can walk right from the front to the back and not be in passenger areas. So, it looks like we're going upstairs now. So, let's head up to deck five where we're going to take a look at the lower atrium area. Headphones. Main restaurant. It's actually not. Let's go up the staircase. This is so weird that this is an actual ship. So look how much it transforms. It's crazy. And when you think already 45% of it is actually already outfitted. So it really is just the finishing touches. So I think this is where the like the champagne bar is. You can see where the staircase is, the Schwankowski staircases are. So right behind us. Oh yeah, look at that. Can you see the staircases? They're awesome. Should we walk around? So if I remember correctly, we had a shop on this side, was that right? Yeah, there was like a shop, shop and a here. bar. Yeah, atrium bar. So guys, just behind us we have the main gallery. I don't know if you can remember it from the MSC yeah. Meraviglia. So you can probably tell this is where they're going to put in the LED roof, and this is the main thoroughfare in the, on the ship. Yeah, you've got butchers cut up there, and then you had the uh, the, the kitsu, kitsu. Yeah, the uh, sushi bar, and you had the chocolate shop. Yeah. And stuff. So you can. This is the first bit where you've been able to instantly it tell what it is. So crazy though. It's just so nuts when you think about all of the stuff that are under. The actual surface yeah. of the, the ship. Should we go and have a look? Let's have a wander down. There will be a huge transformation of the indoor areas of MSC Bellissima over the next six months. Yeah, Kato's there. Butcher's Cut is there. That's the MSC Plaza. It's so weird. Because it's like exactly the same. But I know. like, I'm like, I had dinner up there. Well, as well. It's really weird. Some parts look really small and some parts yeah. look really big. Like this looks huge. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. it does. It looks like massive. compared to the finished thing. But like that bit there looked tiny. Mm. But I remember that being really huge. It was weird. See, this looks a lot bigger. I remember this being really small. <clears throat> you can see where they're going to put in the uh, gelato bar because you can see the um, the surfaces oh, yeah, the at freezes, the back. The yeah. freezers. That is awesome. The Galleria really is the central hub of the ship. It's full of exciting things, shops, bars, restaurants. Here we can see the chocolate shop and what it looks like on the Meraviglia. And that, this was Italy, I think. If you haven't already, make sure you check out our MSC Meraviglia tour and vlog series. There you got the pub just up there. In the studio. And here we have one of the hot spots on the ship, the Meraviglia Bar and Lounge. So we've got the theatre down there, guys, which is unfinished yet. You can see they've got the lighting rig on the ground there. So next we headed up to deck 12, one of the cabin decks. You're not going to find any elevators on this ship yet, so it was stairs all the way up. Let's go up. Literally, I can't get over how bizarre this is. It's so weird because it looks like a ship, but it's just really strange. So it's on deck seven now. We're going to go up even further. And the staircases at the moment are literally just steel. There's no carpet or furnishings. It's literally steel. So now we will enter in the cabin area. You have to imagine first because it's free of cabin. So in the first, uh, let's say, 40 meters, you will see nothing. But to imagine how it is before the loading of the cabin, you will see on your left, uh, as we name it, uh, outside lift, from where we, we lift the cabins. The cabins, we, we use a roller, and then we enter in the vessel 
uh, like Lego, for example. So you will first have a free area and then an area where the cabins are loaded. Okay. So guys, here's a tour of our balcony cabin here on the MSC Bellissimo. Oh, hang on. It's actually not here. Look at this though. This is the actual cabin deck. And all the cabins are missing. The thousands of cabins are all actually prefabricated before they even come onto the ship. They're brought up on huge lifts like this one, then rolled into place like Lego blocks. They're literally just plug and play. And here we can see the unfinished balconies. And oh my god, that is a long, long way down. You can see the balcony cabin doors have already been installed. Okay, so we're here on the balcony. Look how crazy this is. You can actually see all the way through to the end of the ship with the balconies. It's so crazy to see it like this because all the doors and everything are ready. It's nuts. Here on the left, we have some recent installed cabins. They're just needed to be plugged into the electrics and plumbing, and then they're ready to go. It really makes you appreciate the huge space that these cabins fill. Bonjour. Bonjour. Good day. How is your family? So come with us all the way to the outdoor pool decks to have a look at the progress out there. So hi guys, now we're on the top deck, I think we're on deck 16 maybe. And yeah, this is the outdoor area. So behind me you can see the pool and we've got the hot tub spaces. And yeah, it looks really cool. It looks absolutely massive. I know, and if you just look over to the side there as well, they've literally just laid the floor this morning. Oh really? Yeah, so that's why oh, we yeah, can't walk still over wet. there. Yeah, you yeah, can see the floor still wet. And they've already started putting some of the floor on the, the deck Flooring doors. Flooring downstairs, and you can see where the screen's going to be. But yeah, you can see, you can totally tell it's the Maravilla class yeah. already, can't but you? But doesn't it feel like three times the size when you see it without anything it in it? It feels gigantic. Yeah. So I don't know if you can see that, guys, but that floor is wet because it's just been laid this morning. So yeah, that's what the, uh, the floor looks like. I think a bottle's blown into it, which is a bit of a shame. I don't know if you can see just there. Hopefully it doesn't ruin the floor. But yeah, I can't describe enough how massive it looks when it's got nothing in. It's just huge. And obviously there we've got the, the gym and the sky bar. The windows are all in, it just needs finishing off a little bit. It's like an absolute miracle that this can just all come together, and it will do. Do you fancy a slice of pizza? Do you reckon it's open? Pizza bar just there. I don't think it opens. Ice cream bar. Champagne bar's definitely open. It's not going to open till April. This is incredible. It's mad, isn't it? It is bonkers when you see it and you just think, literally less, is it what? How long until it? A couple of months. A couple of months yes. and it'll be months. done. Yeah, it's, it's absolutely bizarre. And I just think it's incredible. This is awesome. So we've got the solarium before it gets it through. So you can already see the really big holes for the uh, the two really big hot tubs down there. Oh yeah, and there's the hot tub there as well. This is so weird. Here you see they've started to fill the pool. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is so small. cool. Yeah, it does, it but it's really huge cool. in real life, isn't it? In real life. We are in real life, by the way, just FYI. This is quite possibly real life. We're on deck 18 now, where we're going to have a look at some of the MSC Yacht Club areas. Yacht Club. Yacht Club. So guys, now we're just upstairs in the Yacht Club, and it is so cool up here, yeah. isn't it? Imagine, I can imagine myself sat here with a cocktail, looking at a nice view. It's just amazing. Yeah, it looks incredible, yeah. So like I said earlier, they're going to put a staircase in right behind us, where we're stood now. And that's oh, new, isn't it? That yeah. wasn't on the Maravilla. And that's going to all go up to the next level, which is going to be the restaurant. It's cool. And just in front of the Bellissima, you can see the first building blocks for the MSC Grandiosa. Make sure you subscribe to our channel because we're going to be back on MSC Bellissima in a few months to see how she's doing. Oh, boo guys, we've got to get off now. That was absolutely amazing. We hope you enjoyed our little tour of the unfinished Bellissima, but it's going to be amazing to compare it to the final thing when we finally get on the, the finished product. Yeah, it's already looking beautiful and you can so see all of the different areas are coming together. But it's just a miracle that all of these millions and millions of different pieces can be brought together to look like 
an amazing, beautiful ship. So yeah, so we're gonna go to the coin ceremony now. So yeah, just watching where I'm standing because I've got a, a nasty habit of hitting my head on things. But yeah, now we're gonna head for the coin ceremony of the Grandiosa, which is actually just behind. You would have saw in some shots there that we filmed the Grandiosa from the top floor from the yacht club. So just behind me guys, we've got one of the first blocks for the Grandiosa. So once they've got the Bellissima out of the way, she's floated out, they'll then start bringing in all the blocks for it and then connect it together like a giant Lego set. But just look at it, it is incredible how that then turns into that. Make sure you subscribe to us right now so you don't miss out on our next videos of the MSC Bellissima. Join us next time where we're going to take a look at the Grandiosa coin ceremony as well as getting right underneath MSC Bellissima for the amazing float out ceremony. That's it till next time. Happy cruising.